so this is August 10th and on July 6th was the last time that we extracted honey from the from our two hives last time we checked them they were just the the honey was full but not capped over today is like super super hot and this hive here is bearding because they're hot so we're hoping to give them a little extra room if we can get this honey out of here so hold on we'll do what we call hive number two first okay so we've got some that one's mostly capped let's see the other side yeah let's try the next frame So between the two hives, um, if we can get 10 frames, then we'll extract today. There ain't none of them full. No? How's the next one down? No. I think we need to move on to hive number one, don't you? Yep, that other one there next to it, no. Yeah. So this is hive number two, that or cool. number one, I'm sorry. Yeah, it looks like some good honey. The other side good? Yeah. Okay, let me get my brush. I'm going to brush that off and then get that one ready to go in the trash bag. Watched a video last night of some people that have some plastic tubs that they put theirs in instead of the trash bags but right now the wheelbarrow and the trash bags work just fine for us later on we might get some trash bag or uh, plastic tubs which would be good okay so we're gonna get busy at this so we ended up with six frames and decided to go ahead and extract and we have a, a hand crank extractor which does real well it holds two frames at a time. And we just bring them in like this in the bag. And then we use um, a capping roller. And then these here, these have already been extracted and they'll go back in the hive number one and the bees will rework this and fill it all back up. They'll just make it all full again. They're pretty amazing. So three times extracting this year um, is, is pretty impressive between these two hives. And I'd say probably maybe less than a month and we should be able to extract from that other one we had.